I've been a head teacher for a long time and also I, I, I've worked with children my whole life and so I feel like I've got the experience and, and to tell a story. But still when Foxfield Primary School was placed into special measures, the walk from the office out into the car park and, and the drive home is an experience I'll never forget. Despite being an NLE, despite 15 years plus of being a head teacher, I still felt that I was to blame for what happened in that school and I took it very personally but I think that in the book what I describe is how drawing on the um, the skills of other people creating an environment where where we all are invested in in each other's successes we could overcome that challenge alongside that there was a clarity and purpose to what we knew needed to happen we didn't duck the difficult issues. We didn't dodge the, the awkward questions. We, we addressed what needed to change and we did it deeply and we did it really well. But the initial feelings of, 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 of being the head teacher of a school in special measures was hugely challenging and again representative of the, the problem we have in our education system where we can be defined by uh, a set of test scores or we can be defined by an Ofsted grade. Again, I think we've got to change that narrative so that we can be more empowered to lead more confidently for the betterment of our children and, and our communities.